Hello, hello everybody. It's Terry Miller and Eddie Rodriguez. How you doing everybody? Smile and wave America, right Eddie? Woohoo! Love it. <laughs> I wish I could get us both in here at the same time. <laughs> I could probably get behind you. Okay, if you want to do that. Yeah. Sure. Hello everybody. Where are you? It's time for some gratitude. <laughs> Here we go. I hope you're all having an amazing day and you're sharing big smiles. Absolutely. Smile and wave wherever you go and show how grateful you are for life. Right, Eddie? Absolutely. Go from your heart. Have that gratitude in your heart. Share it with the people around you and just have an amazing time. Watch how many smiles you get and how many people open their hearts to you. Right. Hi, Paula. Thank you for being on here. We have an audience. Oh, woo -woo. <laughs> like an audience. <laughs> Thank you all for joining us. Hi, Debbie. You're my gratitude person today. And I, we want to come see you. Eddie and I were just talking. We want to come Absolutely. across that big pond and do a <laughs> happiness in the park, just like we're going to do one here in Miami on August 26th. Absolutely. That would be Hi. wonderful. Thank you for those hearts. And yes, yeah, so let us know if there's a park by you, and we'll come see you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll bring the team and have a happiness in the park. Have a great time. Yes, absolutely. Oh, yes, that would be so lovely. I can hear you saying that with your English accent. <laughs> I imagine that sounds beautiful. You know? <laughs> and she says there is a park. Ooh, awesome! Nice. We're, we're there. <laughs> yeah, we got to set that up. <laughs> yes, we, we just did a planning session, Eddie and I, about yeah. our Happiness in the Park event on August 26th in Miami, Florida. All of you, write that on your calendars because it's going to be amazing. We have some great stuff planned for you. Absolutely. And we have chosen to donate to a charity with this event. Eddie, do you want to tell them? Yes, it will be autism. Yes. We're going to be donating to autism. We will have uh, autistic children out there. Uh, we're also going to have handicap. It's going to be an amazing event for a beautiful cause. And we're going to also break a world record for most people smiling and waving simultaneously. I set the world record last time uh, when I did Happiness in the Park in 2010. So now we're going to recreate it. We want to get about a thousand plus people out there and really blow this thing away. Yes, absolutely. So come join us and be a part of that. We want as many people as we can. We're also talking about doing a walk for autism. Yes. And we will be giving a lot more information about this once we get everything together and we'll let you all know exactly what the timing is and where it will be. We, we're hoping for one venue, but when we know for sure, we'll let you know. Yeah. So we need all of your support. And if you're not here local, you can still support us. You know, support us with letting people know, putting the word out, and also with donations. So we'll let you all know when that happens, and thank you in advance. <laughs> we're going to use that power of gratitude and put out there that uh, it's going to be wonderful and amazing, and we'll have the best possible outcome for this event. Woohoo! Yes! <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh. Thank you for the hearts. Also, if you have talent, if you're in the area and you have talent, or you know somebody who, who has talent, things like that, we're looking for people to put in our talent show. So that would be amazing. Yes. Yeah, send anybody our way, and, and let's put this thing together and have a phenomenal time with it. Yes, absolutely. And we give so much gratitude to all of you. Hi, Lisa Joe. Lisa's out in California. Hi, Lisa. And she will be at my Angel Speakers Live event that I'm going to do in November out there. Oh, I'm nice. hoping to drag Eddie out there with me. <laughs> hey, I'd love to go to California. I'm there's some gonna... there's some great parks in California, Eddie. Yes, there are. Yes, there are. We <laughs> want to do this nationwide, actually yeah. worldwide. Yeah. We want to start bringing happiness in the park everywhere. And this will be Happiness in the Park, The Return. Yes. So it'll be the second one, and we'll just continue with it and make it grow. And you know what? We're going to bring a lot more smiles because we need more smiles these days. Yes. Uh, yeah. Put that energy out there. Put that positive energy out there. Yeah. And just get people just happier and smiling and, and just doing whatever we can to share our hearts with the people out there that need it. Absolutely. Lisa just said hello to you. 
Ah, thank you, Lisa. And <laughs> Jennifer, my friend Jennifer is on here. She lives in Miami. Hi, Jennifer. So thank you, Jennifer, for Thanks being for on being here on. today. And happy Saturday to you as well. <laughs> so let's talk about our gratitude lesson today from... The Magic by Rhonda Byrne. Those of you that are following along, we're on day 26. Yes, Lisa wow. Joe, we're raising the vibration. <laughs> so we're almost done with this book. And the lesson today, I really like it, is to magically transform mistakes into blessings. Eddie, have you ever made a mistake? Oh, I've made tons. <laughs> I make mistakes every day. <laughs> and I tell you what, I really am grateful for them. Because I learned so much. Right. The so, life lessons. Absolutely. Some of the biggest mistakes I've made, I've got the biggest lessons. Yeah. So it's, it's yeah, yeah, very grateful. Absolutely. And, <laughs> and that's what we're going to do. That's your exercise that you're going to do tomorrow is look at the mistakes you've made and don't look at them as something negative. Look at what you learned from them. What did you gain from that absolutely. mistake? Because, you know, nothing happens by accident or coincidence. Yeah. So when we make what we consider to be a mistake, there's a reason for that. And yep. there's, you know, there's something that you can find gratitude in with doing that. And Rhonda, in the book, she gives the example of, like, if you get a speeding ticket, okay? <laughs> Anybody ever done that before? <laughs> Not me. That's a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> That's definitely Heavy a mistake. Foot. So what, what she suggests is like if something like that happens, be grateful for the police that are protecting us. They're there for a reason. Yeah. Be grateful that they slowed you down and made you stop and think what you were doing because of the dangerousness. Would you like somebody speeding and you know maybe have an accident? So be grateful for the lessons that you learn in each situation, whatever your mistake was, really examine it because there was a reason for it happening. You know, so look at what that reason was and then put out the gratitude. So that's what the exercise is tomorrow. Try to think of like three things, three mistakes you've made in your life. We've all made them. Don't don't be hard on yourself because you made a mistake. I have made so many mistakes in my life, but you know, I've learned my lessons from them. And I don't want to repeat those mistakes. <laughs> so I'm grateful that I learned the lessons. I'm grateful that now I stop and think before I act and get myself into another bad situation, you know, like I have in the past. So there's so much about it that we can be grateful for every day. And I want to hear if you all resonated with this uh, exercise after you do it. When you come on tomorrow, I'll be on here at 5 tomorrow. And tell me, you know, I did that exercise and wow, you know, look at, at what's happened. Look at what I figured out that from that mistake that I can find gratitude. We can find gratitude in everything in life. Everything. everything. I'm so grateful for meeting Eddie. I'm so <laughs> grateful that we, we are co-creating <laughs> this big event oh, yeah. down in Miami. It's going to be awesome. I, I tell you what. One of the biggest mistakes I ever made in my life brought me the biggest growth and the most happiness. Mm -hmm. so back in, in 2006, I drank a Monster. Oh, yeah, what a mistake. I drank that before. Uh, yeah, I ended up having a cerebral hemorrhage. Ooh. I had three veins that burst in the back of my brain, filled my brain with blood, and basically I slept on a, a lazy boy because I couldn't sleep in bed. Six months to learn how to walk. Six months to learn how to talk. Nine, nine years to rebuild my brain. Yeah. But that's what created Smile and Wave America. Yeah. So what a wonderful thing that happened from a yeah. huge mistake that almost killed me. Wow. That's one of the things that I'm grateful for. We were talking about that earlier. I yes. said, thank God for cerebral hemorrhages. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, it, it, it was a fabulous thing. Yeah. So make those mistakes, learnings, understandings of things that you can really create beauty in your life with. Absolutely. Thank you, Eddie. And, Eddie, I want to to see your shirt. Ah. Isn't 10 Million that Smiles World I Tour. <laughs> I love that shirt. And we're going to have a shirt for our event yes. down in Miami, <laughs> the Happiness in the Park event. So um, even if you can't be there at the event, maybe you'll purchase a shirt and contribute in that way. Lorraine's here. Thank you, Lorraine, for being Hi, Lorraine. on here. 
And you know, Eddie, I've made a mistake just recently and uh -oh. ended up cracking my head open. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but one thing that I've learned, and I'm really grateful now, one thing that I've learned is that I need to slow down. I need to prioritize. I need to really see, you know, what I need to be doing and uh, taking control of my life again instead of just, you know, plugging along and keep going and keep, you know, pedaling as fast as I can. I really need to put thought into what I'm doing and have everything have a significant meaning to it. Hi, Adrian. Thank you for jumping on here. Happy Saturday. Hi, Adrian. <laughs> and, so, you know, we're very grateful that you're okay from that, that bump on your oh, head. thank you. And for the things that you've learned from yeah. it and the fact that you took a little bit of time to slow down and start thinking about things and organizing. That's yeah. wonderful. Yeah. That, I really feel like that's what the universe was telling me. That yeah. was my message. That's a message. You know, yeah. There's a message in everything. Everything. And that was mine. And I'm <laughs> listening. Amazing. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I got to learn that better. Listen, yeah. listen, listen. <laughs> So, for tomorrow, what you're going to do is when you first get up, make your gratitude list. Ten things you're grateful for. And why are you grateful for those things? You know, a lot of people can make a gratitude list. We can just, like, rattle off what we're grateful for. But why are you grateful for those things? And then say those magic words, thank you, thank you, thank you. And then the next thing you'll do is write down like three things, three mistakes you've made and look at what the lesson was and be grateful for the lesson. Yep. Be grateful for the, the whole thing happening because it taught you something and now you're, you're different from it. You know, something happened and it made you really stop and think. So be grateful for that. And then the last thing you do at night is hold your magic rock. Do you have a magic rock? I absolutely do. Me too. So you hold your magic rock at night. I hold mine right up to my heart. Here's mine. Oh, awesome. I love I your magic rock. Me. I have two. <laughs> yes. I have this one and I have an amethyst. Oh, nice. I always carry with me. Yeah, beautiful. <laughs> so when you hold your magic rock, reflect back on your day and think of what was the very best thing that happened to you today. And then be grateful for that. And that's how you'll drift off to sleep, is thinking gratitude thoughts. Beautiful How things. wonderful is that? And you'll wake up the next morning with that still on your mind and be in a really good mood when you wake up. I've been doing this most of my last three years, ever since I discovered the magic rock and discovered the power of gratitude. And that's the last thing I think of, is what am I grateful for that happened today? And doing that just makes such a difference. It's turned my life around. You know, gratitude has really changed my life. It's a, gratitude is such an amazing thing. It's actually yeah. turned my life around as well. And there's one thing that I do in the morning when I wake up after the gratitude at night. I wake up in the morning and say, who's going to show up today? Yeah. And that is an amazing question to ask yourself. It is. That means that somebody's going to show up mm -hmm. in your life that day and make some beautiful things happen with you. Yes. I always ask, what adventure can I have today? There you go. That's a good one, too. <laughs> yeah. Adventures are great. Yes, they are. <laughs> so you guys know me. You know the last thing I talk about on my happy hour is world peace. Eddie, do you want to see world peace? Oh, I definitely want to see world peace. That's, that's what it's all about is getting as many people to smile, to be happy, and to work together as a community as we can all across the world. Yes. So, yeah, yes. that's something that I, I think about every single day. Me too. I'm going to help create it. Yeah, and I'm working hard at that. I am the Peace Ambassador for the state of Florida. Mm -hmm. And if you want to work with me, anybody out there that wants to work with me, just let me know and I will hook you up. <laughs> we can work together to Absolutely. bring world peace to be a reality. And when become you're, a happiness ambassador. Yes. And when you're on social media, use the hashtag, I choose peace. Because that's, that's a statement all by itself. Yes. It tells everybody what you're all about, that you want peace and happiness, joy and smiles. You don't want all of that hatred and division. No, 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 we want no. to just share the happiness wherever we go. We're happiness ambassadors. See that? You're yeah. a happiness ambassador. Happiness ambassadors. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want one of these wonderful bands, 
you can contact Eddie. Eddie, tell them how to get in touch with you. Well, you can go to my website, which is smileandwaveamerica.com, or you can email me at smileandwaveamerica at gmail.com. Let me know that you want a wristband, which actually has been, it's an energetic wristband. It was blessed by Tibetan monks. They chanted on it for 15 minutes, and I myself put a bunch of different informations on there, love, family, prosperity, joy, all types of things. So it's, uh, you definitely want one of these. They are incredible. They and are. it reminds you to smile. Yes, it does. And, yeah. you know, Eddie, I haven't taken mine off since I put it on <laughs> the day I met you. <laughs> That's awesome. Woohoo! Yes. So if you want one, get in touch with Eddie and let's share that out there, that you're a happiness ambassador. Absolutely. You're a person that wants happiness in the world. Yep. So thank you all. Thank you for joining me. And hi, Janet. I saw you jump on here. And you choose peace, love, and light. Absolutely, honey. That's what it's all about. It is. Thank you all for the hearts. Thank you for joining us. And I Beautiful. hope you have a great rest of your day and tonight. And I'll be back on tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern Time with Lesson 27. We're almost done with this book. And thank you all for joining in. And you know it's on YouTube. Every lesson is on YouTube. So if you know somebody that could benefit from that, let them know. Share this out. Share the message out. Oh, Absolutely. you're so welcome, Debbie. <laughs> you're so welcome, honey. I send you all love and light. And just have a beautiful day. Eddie? Thank you all. And I just want to say, remember that your smile is amazing. And I thank you for sharing it. Have a wonderful day, everybody, and a fabulous weekend. Keep smiling. Absolutely. Bye, everybody. I love you. Bye. Bye love now. You.